So, just a quick update on the uh, bulletproof pla uh, plastics that uh, you would have seen Rob firing at. Um, I press them in a little mould like this, and we are continuously uh, trying to improve the process and what's going into them to make them as good as we can. Each time I use this mould, you get residue of the plastic around it, as you can see there, and I have to clean that up to make sure that it's good enough to press the following time. Now, there's a very thin film of the plastic on that mould. I use a knife to take it off, usually. This blade is a lot thicker and a lot harder, supposedly, than that plastic, but the last time I used this blade to clean this one, I've just turned it round, so I'll turn it back to show you. It actually broke the tip of the blade. I don't know if you can see it there. So we've got a blade tempered steel to cut through things, you know, that are meant to be quite difficult to cut through, and it snapped on that bit of plastic. So how hard this plastic is, I, I have no idea. Really. Okay, so there's two things in my mind that we should take away from this. Not only how tough the plastic is, but how easily it bonds to metal. So if we need to coat, if we need to coat metal uh, panel or anything with this stuff for any reason, for any application, there's been nothing done to that metal to make it easier for that plastic to bond to it. So it's just one process as far as I can see. But there's also another uh, thing I want to show you, and that's the conductivity of this plastic. Okay, so I've got just a two-point probe on this. It's about an inch apart, I, I guess. Give it a good press. So this one, it has been better. This one's about five and a half ohms, which is pretty impressive for a conductive plastic. And as you can see, these probes, I've bent one of them. <laughs> but it hasn't marked the plastic. Okay, so we've got a plastic that uh, Rob has demonstrated is obviously uh, bulletproof, but there's so many other uses for this plastic. It sticks like you wouldn't believe. It's as tough as old boots, and I keep ruining my tools trying to test against it. So we have here something quite amazing.